Tonight, a freshman Indiana state senator is pushing for a task force to study how the state can eliminate traffic fatalities. Democratic Senator Andrea Hunley is proposing a bill tonight to create the Vision Zero Task Force. And tonight, 13 News State House reporter Emily Longnecker explains how the task force would work. Senator Hunley told me preventing deaths is not a partisan issue and SB 233 had overwhelming support in the Senate with a majority of lawmakers voting for the bill. I'm here today because my family, my family, oh, sorry guys. A mother overwhelmed for a moment with emotion, telling Indiana lawmakers last month why more needs to be done to prevent Hoosiers from dying in traffic crashes. I'm here today because my family has been directly impacted by the unsafe conditions on Washington Street. In September 2021, Cassandra Crutchfield's seven-year-old daughter Hannah was killed in a school crosswalk on Washington Street when multiple cars speeding down the street collided and hit Hannah, her mom, and a school crossing guard right in front of Hannah's school. And now her family and the entire community, you know, has been completely changed forever because of that. Senator Andrea Hunley, who represents a large part of Marion County, including the Irvington area where Hannah lived, believes deaths like Hannah's can be prevented. She's proposed the state establish a Vision Zero task force to eliminate all traffic fatalities. And if we've designed a system that has problems, I believe that we can design a system that has solutions. The task force of experts and lawmakers would meet four times a year to study traffic crashes across the state and file an annual report with recommendations about what safety improvements could be made to prevent similar crashes going forward. The Indiana Criminal Justice Institute says so far this year there have been 128 crashes in Indiana with 142 fatalities, with most crashes happening on rural roadways. 13 of those fatal crashes have happened in Marion County. According to the Institute, these were the top five locations for fatal crashes in Marion County in 2022. What we're talking about, though, is an individual member of someone's family. We are talking about a family that has been impacted for the rest of their lives. Senator Hunley says Hannah Crutchfield's family is just one of a growing number. SB 233 has been assigned to the House's Roads and Transportation Committee. So far, it has not been scheduled for a hearing. At the State House, Emily Longnecker, 13 News.